Hey guys, it's uh, Gary from Green Mountain CrossFit. In this video, we're going to talk about how the male, male's weights is going to be structured, laid out for uh, the Tabata 2 rep and how he's going to load the bar. What we've got on here are both the rec and the open division weights. So you can see here, all the weights are pretty much the same, but in the rec division, we're starting off with 75 pounds as opposed to 95 pounds. Um, the point structure will be the same. So the first open weight is 95 pounds, you get two points per rep for that. In the rec division, it's 75 pounds, you get two points a rep for that. So they correlate the same, it's just you're starting at a different place. All right? So, We'll come see our setup here. Male athlete is set up and ready to go. Nick has the rec weight on the bar already. He's got 75 pounds on there. He's got two 15 pound plates. The reserve weights you have to choose from as we go. We have one five pound steel plate, one on each side. We have got three 10 pound bumper plates, one 25 pound bumper plate, and then a 45 pound bumper plate. All the stations will be set up exactly like this so that these are the weights you're going to have to um, use and we'll show you how we're going to structure that at first. So Nick has got 75 pounds in the bar, the next weight he has to hit is 85 pounds. So he's going to take his five and slap her on there. Now he's got 85 pounds in the bar. Next weight is 95 pounds. Everything comes off. 25 pound goes on each side. Now he's got 95 pounds on the bar. The next weight is 115. One of the 10 pound bumper plates goes on. Now he's got 115 on the bar. Next up is 135 pounds. Everything comes off. 45 pound goes on. And there's our 135. Next up is 155. 10s go back on. Next weight is 185 pounds. Tens come off. 45 pounds go on. Next up is 205. Tens go on. 205 pounds in the bar. Two and a quarter is next. 225 pounds. There we go. There's 225. And then the last weight is 245 pounds. We're going to add that final 10 pound bumper plate for our final weight, right? So that is exactly how you will need to load your bar through that weighted progression for the men, right? We will have uh, probably a written thing here, a piece of paper or something on the ground so you know that, but please practice this because the more efficient you are with that weight transfer, the more time you get to breathe before you have to lift again, all right? I'll see you guys on the 11th.